You don't see. So what's good, everyone on YouTube? This is Very Melon Man, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Yakuza 6, The Song of Life. So what I'm doing right now is simply... Picking out. Right now. So what have I gotten here? Well, stats are boosted, but more important than that, I unlock the boost XP gain skills. There's ones for each category, as well as ones for boosting meal experience and your hunger gauge. Why not? Now, let's resume our, um, after taking a break in order to deal with the, uh, sub-stories of Onomichi. We can add some characters to our strike team. Now, if you're wondering why I rearranged my chairman lineup to look like this, pay attention to the hierarchy. Basically, I found out that if you link up two characters together and they have... And they have a relationship with one another established, then the characters in the story will automatically We'll give us some sort of buff. Yep, Unfortunately, Kiryu and the Pocket Circuit Fire are not an example of this, but... The most obvious example would be Kiryu and Majima. And because they're shaking hands, they have a relationship with each other. And because of this, something will happen. No one's actually figured out what exactly the buff is supposed to be. But as long as the characters are connected to one another through this chain, that's not too important. Not too important at all. You can use Kiryu's experience points gained during the story in order to strengthen up your characters as well, I've been made aware of, so... We also have taken all the experience point boosters we can for the... main story. So, during the matches themselves, we'll also get way more experience points than we did beforehand. Now then. Time to take down Yano of the Six Lunatics. Kiryu-kun. <laughs> ああ。それじゃ行くぞ。俺たちの力。見せてやろうぜ。おう。うす。六強人の一人であるヤノを倒せば Oh, 
In New Japan Pro Wrestling, there are plenty of hot blade, well chiseled, brave as all get out athletes. From a purest ace to cocky as to the most disrespectful slacker. All the same fire and determination to win their matches. Toru Yano is not one of those pro wrestlers. And yet he has wins over so many fantastic talents like them, though I should even underestimate him. For who knows what he's going to do next, and what deaths will go to do it. So Toru is a comedic wrestler. Finishing a successful career as a Greco-Roman wrestler for Nihon University, joined the New Japan Wrestling's Token Club, viewed for the post-2002. Yano is primarily a comedic wrestler, rarely if ever fights fair. <laughs> Stability, why not? Pulling every dirty trick in the book and then some. Would be his opponents, usually making the fool of himself and our other wrestlers in the process. However, because of perhaps in spite of his silly nature, Yano has a reputation of a spoiler in New Japan Pro Wrestlers tournaments. Frequently eliminating fan favorites and creators that are. Frequently eliminating fan favorites and characters that are portrayed as way, way better than him at wrestling losing upsets. Usually stealing something there is why he looks up to the exit ramp. So, he's definitely a heel dude. My kind of dude. You aren't stealing this victory from me, Toru Yano. Yes, well, you see, the thing is, I actually got really good fighters to join my posse. You didn't. Give me your firearm. Yeah. <laughs> 
Dragon Edge of Physics, everyone. The explosives were a nice touch, I have to admit. ついに。ジョン。<笑> お前はジョー。トランキーロ。あっせんだ。おう。イエー。テツユナイト。ナイト。岡田に並ぶ実力者です。ワアミヒバービー、ヒビオカーゲットディ。ニュージャパンプロレスリング。ジョー。ジョー
キリュウちゃんに惚れたんだよねこれからお世話になるわよろしく調子のいいやつだねまあでもこいつの強さは本物だ<笑>内藤を倒すにはこっちの戦力も増やさねえとな任せとけって正直俺もあんな風に切り捨てられたチームに未練はねあるのは恨みだけだ、うん、俺にもプライドがあるからよジャスティスぶし協力させてもらうぜああよろしく頼むパクソン<笑>やのトールに任せとけよ次の相手の内藤は今まで以上のメンバーを率いてるって噂ですあいつが率いてる連中は俺の仲間のガキンチョどもとはちょっと質が違うまあ注意した方がいいぜ準備しっかりしていかねえときついかもな分かったイントレスティングユーオンリーアシルバーラーティーキャラクターヒュートルーインキワミトゥーユーゴールラーティー Black market. 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 So now we're getting to the point where we need multi stage areas. Interesting. <sighs> Games only gonna get longer. Look at Toru just being his 
Toru, so. Alright. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna have Tyrannus and Stars. Oh, I thought there'd be multiple areas in this one. Okay. Alright, Naito, your three star missions will treat like a three star opponent and <laughs> just keep going. <laughs> Majra Akiyama, are you ready? Fight. And the fight ends as soon as the actual arena leader goes down. Interesting. あるね。さすがもっと登場会4代目。この短期間でよくチームをまとめたもんだ。ナイト。チームバトル
あ,あ万が一にも勝てたらの話だけどな<笑>今までのはお遊びだ次は全力で行かせてもらうぜせっかく固まってきたチームがやられて悲しそうな顔してるあんたが目に浮かぶよ<笑>現実になるのが今から楽しみだぜおい内藤あトランキールあっせんなよてめえ覚悟しとけ次は内藤との最終決戦だ気合い入れていかねえとなああ Oh, I thought that was the showdown with Naito, because it's like, why else would Naito show I, I forgot this is how it was male. Bartender. The back of the merchant talked to you about the vacant call. He said it was okay to tell you about him, so he wanted me to check out the vacant lot in Hana no Kubo. Cool. Let's take out the rest of the Yano army first, and then we'll move on to Naito. <coughs> Slash him up. Yeah. Armor up. Let's see, 300 dudes in clan battles. Not bad. Ooh, Rasan gets to the point where we need to actually pay attention to our unit's health. We can't just. We cannot literally just sit back and do nothing. And watch the fireworks go down. Oh man, 
Tetsuya Naito. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. そろそろ行くぞ。おや、ライトをぶっ潰してやろうぜ。よっしゃ。お。ブエナスノーチェス、キリュさん。じゃあ。お前の望み通り来てやったぜ。決着をつけよう。言われなくてもその積もりだ。
big damage. Two for one. Sorry, you're not the champion today, Naito. Kiryu-san,Naito <laughs> いちょ約束したからな。物道侵略はねえよ。あとはカムロ町に乗り込むだけだな。おかだ。待ってろよ。おい、キリュさんよ。ん俺はあんたやジョーみたいな感情や男気で動く連中が嫌いだった。だが、
それで進めてくれアウェーでの戦いはもうおしまいだここからが本番だあいつらを手厚く出迎えてやらないとわかりましたじゃあ桐生一馬これで尾道はなんとかなりそうですね。残りの六強人たちはカムロ町で待ち構えてます。いつカムロ町に乗り込むかはまだ決めてないんですけど、とりあえず今は来たる時に備えて尾道でチームを強くしておきましょう。今の状態で突っ込んでも帰り口に合うでしょうから。そうだな。当分は尾道で奴らと戦う準備をしておこう。Hear you, clan captain. Okay. So it looks like all that influence is directly proportional to how much. So I guess that means we genuinely have to move the story to the point where we can travel back to Kamen Roadshow before we can actually do anything. That's fine. Six Chairman's Dignity. And that's why Daigo is such a ridiculously powerful unit. He immediately fills up the deployment gauge, so everyone gets the chance to be summoned immediately and can take go to town. Everyone else. Chop him up. Yeah. <laughs> 
Eventually, buff stacking becomes the ore of the day. ってすごいところなんですね。尾道とは全然違うな。いらっしゃい。Alright then, so it looks like we are honestly done with Clan Creator until we get the Kamurocho. So, uh, thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, uh, leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys when we get to doing some more side activities in the next episode. Take care.